This is Central Texas News Now. A new CBD store opened its doors this weekend in Hewitt. Thanks for joining us at 10. I'm Lindsay Lippman. Our own Eliza Navarro joins us now live in the studio with more on what this new store means for our community. That's right, Lindsay. Now, Governor Abbott signed a bill in June that made this new store possible. And I talked with the owner who says she opened the store after CBD products helped her husband. And now she's hoping to help more people locally. Um, and were suggested to try CBD, and so we did, and he saw fabulous results, and he's been, I mean, we've been believers ever since. Cannabid oil, better known as CBD, is the only thing that helped Kimberly Tarantino's husband, Michael, calm his back pain. He uh, damaged his back in high school, and he had a spinal fusion then, and then through the course of about a decade, he had several other th surgeries, including cortisone shots, a uh, TENS unit placed internally and then removed, as well as a second spinal fusion. After positive results from using CBD, Tarantino decided to open her own store in Hewitt. We saw amazing results and I was just so satisfied being able to see my husband finally be able to move on with a regular lifestyle instead of having to be dependent on, you know, pain medications and, um, you know, being out for days at a time because he overexerted himself. Although CBD has worked for him, it's caused a lot of controversy throughout the country. Some saying CBD contains marijuana, but Tarantino says otherwise. CBD is derived not from marijuana, but it's derived from the hemp plant, um, which is in the same category as the cannabis plant. On June 14th of this year, Texas Governor Greg Abbott signed into law Bill HB 3703, a bill that allows the sale of CBD products in Texas. And it is legal to sell this product and obtain this product in the state of Texas with up to 0.3% THC. Now our store does not sell the THC products, but we're happy to order them for our customers. Tarantino hoping her new store will allow the community to have a local place to buy it. I just really hope that Texas can stay with the trend of the rest of the country and be able to pick up its pace on keeping up with the times and making sure that this stays legal and stays available for people that really truly want it and can benefit from it. Now, Tarantino also told me that there will be a second store opening in Waco within a year. I know it's a very hot trend right now, yeah. Eliza. Thank you and welcome to the <laughs> news uh, Channel 25 team as well.